because it's just another manic Monday. Hi you guys, did you have a good weekend? Did you see the solar eclipse? Do you know what that is? It's when the moon passes between the sun and the earth and then it goes in front of the sun and then the sun looks like a ring. I know that because I just Wikipedia'd it. I mean, I know, I know what an eclipse is. I just wanted to make sure that I described it right. Um, remember when we used to make dioramas and stuff out of shoeboxes and that's why you have an issue with throwing out shoeboxes because you're like, what if I need it someday? And then someone who's sensible, they're like, why, why would you need a shoebox? And you're like, because I need it to make a diorama of an eclipse. Um, oh, also this, how did the man on the moon cut his hair? Eclipse it, that is from a Laffy Taffy rapper from high school, and that is what matters. Also, how did the man make his video shorter? Eclipse it. Uh, how, how does the guy get his coupons out of the newspaper? Eclipse them, you got it, you got it. Okay, guess what else? This Wednesday, we have a brand new episode of You Suck at Photoshop for you. Donnie Hoyle will be premiering some new tips. He's not the nicest teacher, but he's good at Photoshop, even though you suck at it. We better prepare for it. Um, here's the most recent episode. My name is Donnie, and you suck at Photoshop. But that's not a me problem, that's a you problem. First of all, I'd like to extend an honorable mention to all of the kinder shoppers who didn't fudge their pull-ups when I asked them to help me spread the, the word to my attorney that the ad we created was placed in legitimate advertising places and that we fulfilled our obligation in, in trade to our lawyer. So. Congratulations, D minus, you passed. But now it's time for you to take a journey. It's time for both of us to take a journey. Let's open up a photo, a photo that says, a second chance has begun. A photo of a cat that your ex-wife rescued without telling you and turned your house into a shit aquarium and it, created all sorts of turmoil but now has returned to you across many continents and tens of thousands of leagues to bring you a token a ring a ring whose powers had once been only used for evil but now we know can can be used once more for good and, and so we want to create an image that says the ring bearer has returned the ring to its rightful owner and and he is going to return to reclaim his throne and we want to put the ring on a pedestal to say I'm ready to love I, or I'm at least I'm ready to spoon and listen to Ashford and Simpson we've got to start somewhere so grab the marquee tool and select a rectangle of the stone floor we're going to use a tool called Repussy and we're going to duplicate the background go to 3d Repussy current selection and Photoshop is going to turn this into a 3D object. A 3D object that we can manipulate in space and, and actually turn into this stone pedestal, one that is worthy of the, the power of the ring that sits upon it. And we can, we can use the 3D manipulator tool to turn it in space to, uh, to scale it change its size to to even move it back against the wall to suggest that it's leaning up against there and we can even change the materials we can change the shape the bevels and and all sorts of details here it's something i'm sure your almond sized brain is in, incapable of understanding the materials i created this material from some of the stone wall we won't take the time to clean this up we would make it look incredibly awesome of course but time is of the essence and so we want to place the ring upon the pedestal and Putai can you no you you can keep my robe but I, I want my members only jacket back our journey begins momentarily 
And now we want to do something bold. Bolder than a cat traveling 17,000 miles to bring a ring back to its rightful owner. We want to create a challenge. A challenge to the man and his son. The only two people who are standing in the way of our happiness. The only two people that we need to take care of. Matt. Do. Uh, oh. Take me to her. Honey, there's someone here to help you. Untie me, you worthless no-deck loser! The power of Christ compels you! Ah, screw your help! I'm Satan's whore! I'll kill you! I'll kill your family! I'll feast on your boners in hell! Ah, cast out! Ah. Ye vile serpent! I'll claw your flesh! I'll suck you off! I'm sorry, did you say... I will suck you off. Maybe you should wait outside. What? Really? Yep. What? I mean, right I really, outside. I right maybe here. Should, right there. Oh, well, okay. You're the expert. Things are about to get uh, real sticky. Whoa! Oh! That woman is full of hellfire. Is she cured? I'm gonna have to... Uh, Call in some colleagues. She's a bit of a handful, if you know what I mean. I don't know what you mean. Yeah. I'm gonna wait in there. You were right. It turns all the way around. Whoa. Hey, weren't you wearing pants when we went in there? <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get it. Thanks, man. Excuse oh. me, Father, but what the hell is going on here? Hey, language, son. I'm a priest for Christ's sake. Uh oh, I'm sorry. You should be. Hey, let's let these guys through. Come on. There we go. Dominic, Marco. All right, we're setting yeah, up on the right. Careful you point that thing. It's okay. My man. Is it over? What? Oh, yeah. Uh, whatever. I'm starving. Honey, my God. You're okay. I will never let you go through that again. What are you talking about? They're coming back tomorrow. You mean... I don't understand. You're still possessed? Possessed? I was never possessed. What? Now untie me, you worthless no-dig loser. That was a sex video to shake you up on a Monday. <laughs> I hope your brains are rattling. I sincerely take that back. That would be a bad thing. That would be a not good thing. I, I forgot to breathe also then a whole bit there. Catching up on that. Also, remember this? Um, how did the man on the moon... It doesn't know he's on the moon anymore. How, did the man, how does the man cut his hair? He, well, he clips it, but how, do, how does the man cut his lawn? He, he clips it. How, how does, how did the man get rid of his tags on his shirt? <laughs> eclipse them. What, what, how, what does Apple call the, the eclipse? The eye clips. Okay, well I hope you're happy. I seriously, I hope you're happy. Uh, I do, I want, and I really hope you're happy.
I'll see you tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern. The great Dave Hill will be here. His new book is called Tasteful Nudes, and it comes out tomorrow. And man, I love him. And on our big Wednesday show, we've got great new video premieres. And are you ready for this? Gilbert Gottfried and The Daily Show's Wyatt Snack. Both of them live, not at the same time. Just watch. See you then. XOXO.